Yes, Nicholas, back again. We're back in MacPap 550, as you can see. Another beautiful theme. I'll show you what it is. Hang on, right? Where are we? We're with Moonlight 3, and it is really nice. So, I mean, really beautiful, but really, really super duper. I'm liking it very much. Right, anyway, somebody put on a post on the comment section. <clears throat> How do I get a VOCO screen lane? Well, that's quite simple, really. And I'm just going to show you how to do it. Now, what I've done, if I go to my file manager, I've actually deleted the VOCO screen file, okay? Although I've still got the other bits that I've unpacked from the zip file here, okay? So we've got the WM1 there. Yeah, the Sid and Wheezy. We've also got the one here for OpenSUSE, because it's available for OpenSUSE 2. And we've also got the one for Hubuntu. And if you're using Precise, you'll want to use this one. So if you're using MacPup 550, this is the file you'll want to use. Now, I'm just going to quickly show you how to go and get it, okay? Because somebody asked me. Okay. So I'll open my browser in just a second. A bit of drinkage while I'm waiting. Hmm. Excuse me. And we'll type in Voco Screen. If I could spell, but not tonight, obviously. So you want to go down to this one here, www.cohoptonline.de slash hp slash. He's a German guy, a really nice bloke. I've had a couple of little conversations, sort of, with him. We've had a few problems, and we both agreed that the new kernel for Ubuntu is a total pants, okay? But this one works really fun. So if you're English, you're going to have to click here for the British flag. So that means America, Australia, the English speaking world. And that's for Ubuntu, <coughs> OpenSUSE, Debian, 32 and 64 bit. So do you want to download it, don't you? Okay. You click on download. We're actually in Puppy Precise here, sorry, MacPup 550, which is based on Puppy Precise, isn't it? So I'll just do the right thing now. And you want to download Vocal Screen. You click here. You want to save the file. And it's a zip file, as you can see, 11.2 megabytes. You click OK. Just do it to root for now. If you're going to keep it as a long-term system, you know what you want to do, okay? If you've used PUP before, you know what you're saying. And it's downloaded already. Okay, that was a nice and quick one. So we'll come out of Firefox. We'll go to our file system. There's a rocks file system. What file? Yeah, you, you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. It's late here, mate. It's late. I need to go to bed. Now, it's a zip file, so all you have to do is basically click on it once. <clears throat> And you can unzip this, and it will give you these folders over here, which is the Debian, the OpenSUSE, and the Buntus. Okay, and all you do is click Extract, and it will extract them to your root folder. From there on, you can move them to wherever you want. Okay, and then you can just click on the, the package of your choice and install it. And like me, like now, I have it for you. We're using Voco Screen, super of the duper. Apparently, I'm only recording at 12 frames a second. I think they're telling me porky pies. The Elsa one, yeah, okay, MKV. I'm having a little few problems at the moment <clears throat> recording games in Zubantu, okay? But that's not a big deal. Once you start doing it, it's fine, okay? Anyway, to minimise it again, you can go over So that's how you download and install a Voco screen in MacPup 550. Another teaser coming for you tomorrow. Sneaky Linux going out. I'll see you later. Bye bye.